They say there's a big man who lives far away, supposedly jolly, but it's hard to say. I've never seen him and neither have you. But the children believe, and I suppose that'll do. He's known as a loner with many a quirk, no time for a chat, he's embroiled in his work. He keeps to himself for most of the year. I reckon we're grateful he doesn't appear. We send him requests for particular needs, but we never hear back, who knows if he heeds. We try to be good, give his arm a twist, to merit our place on his blessed little list. And maybe one day, if we do what we should, he'll give us our things just so long as we're good. <laughs> I've had it to hear, I'm calling his bluff. He's a weird, moralistic dispenser of stuff. Granted, this rant is a strange one to pick, but listen, I'm not really after St. Nick. As strange as he is, and Santa is odd, I'm really addressing most folks' view of God. It's God who we see as some distant big guy, some ancient invisible St. Nick in the sky. He sees you asleep, he knows when you wake, he's watching and waiting to spot your mistake. And just like with Santa, requests we hand in. We want all his things, but we don't want him. That's our connection with old Father Christmas. We might dress it up, it's essentially business. Throughout the year, good behavior's our onus. When Christmas rolls around, we're expecting our bonus. Just leave us our gifts, Nick, we've been good enough. And then please push on, now we've got all your stuff. I mean, Santa is interesting, curious, quirky, but nobody wants him to share their turkey. I'm sure his ho-ho-hos are sublime, but I fear what he'll say once he's drunk our mulled wine. That's old St. Nick, but the picture rings true. It's how we imagine what God is like too. The Christmas resounds with a stunning not so. The one from on high was born down below. To a world in need he did not send another. God the Son became God our brother. He drew alongside forever to dwell. Our God in the flesh, Emmanuel. This God in the manger upends all our notions. A heavenly stooping, divine demotion. Born in a stable, wriggling on straw, fully committed to life in the raw. Santa gives things and then goes away. Jesus shows up to befriend and to stay. Santa rewards those for good behavior. Jesus draws near to the broken as savior. If you don't like God, I think I know why. You probably think he's St. Nick in the sky. You're right to reject that faraway stranger. This Christmas, look down to the God in the manger.